It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Northern Monk Brewing Company and this is a can of their Chock Ice Stout. It's 4.5% ABV in a 440 milliliter can. There's a look at the beer. This beer launched into Sainsbury's. Into Sainsbury's this beer launched and it was three pounds per can. I'm hoping I'm going to like it. I'm not ruling the beer out before I've even opened it. But I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to be straight with you almost straight away here and say that it doesn't fill me with hope. It doesn't fill me with hope. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. A little bit of smoke on the can opening, beer in the glass. We have a two to three finger tan coloured head. It's a jet black beer in the glass. A little bit of carbonation on the beer. The head's sticking around okay. Doesn't seem to be a beer that's going to have great lacing. But let's 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 get in. Let's kind of get the aroma on the beer then. Oh, oh, oh. Um. Smells like a chalk ice. I mean, I'm going to give it to Northern Monk here. In the aroma, the beer smells exactly... If you were just to go into a, your freezer, pick out one of the cheap vanilla sandwich bar chalk ice things, and if you were to kind of like bite into that and smell it at the same time, you're getting the same aroma on the beer. I'm trying to be I'm trying to be fair here because look the people who are buying this beer are obviously interested in like sweet stuff and chalk ices and who am I to say that what well, what a stout like fundamentally should be who am I to kind of I'm just giving you my thoughts i'm just giving you my opinions i'm gonna tell you whether i like the beer or not on a personal level but that doesn't mean to say that the beer shouldn't be brewed because whether i like it or not i'm just giving an opinion what i'm trying to say is as i said just now if you're a fan of chalk ices and you're a fan of sweet stuff then this beer might be for you So let's dive in. It smells like a chalk ice. <laughs> Cheers. I wasn't going into this beer review with much hope. But do you know what? Yes, it's adjuncty. Yes, it's very kind of like non traditional beer. Um, is it craft beer? Uh, uh, it's a stretch. It's a stretch for me to. Like, for me, craft beer is using lots of lovely hops. Lots of lovely malts, different yeast strains, you know, brewing some incredible kind of craft beer. Um, this beer is is quite far away from that. This beer is, and my nostrils are flaring up slowly. <laughs> this beer is, is 
a stout ish it's dark it, it, it's and it, it tastes like chalk ice it tastes like chalk ice and this is the point and this is what i'm struggling with I decided to buy this beer. The reason why I bought this beer is to review it on YouTube. That was the only reason why I bought this beer. If I was buying this beer with my own money to go, hey, it's Sunday afternoon, I like a drink in the garden on a Sunday afternoon, that beer would very much definitely still be on the shelf right now. It's not my own personal consumption. It's not my own kind of like what I would choose to drink but and then on the other hand i'm a beer reviewer i review all of the latest and greatest beers that hit the supermarkets and the, the bottle shops and everything else and and it's part of what i do so i'm really kind of cl conflicted here i'm kind of like 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 it, it's really difficult for me to 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 it tastes like a chalk ice it, it tastes like a chalk ice if you want your beer to taste like a chalk ice, this is the, the, the beer for you. It, it's, it really is. It, it isn't bad at all, actually, on that kind of chalk ice front. Does it taste like a traditional stout? No, absolutely not. There's literally no roasted malt flavour in this beer whatsoever. There's no lovely flavours of fig and plum and prune and roasted malt and roasted malt bitterness and fantastic, terrific malt flavours in the beer, uh, stout flavours in the beer. No, no, there's none of that. There's, there's none of that. So if you just purely look at this as, let's take away the chalk ice, Northern Monk Stout, then it's a blooming awful stout. As a base stout, if I take the chalk ice out of the name, it's an awful stout. It's, it's, it's quite thin it, 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 and, and nothing else. Literally nothing else other than, let me move my fingers away, other than... Chalk ice. And I'm going to go back to that, that, that point in, in who am I to, if somebody wants to go into Sainsbury's and pay £3 for a chalk ice stout, that's completely up to them. It's, it's up to them. It's, it, and that's, that's the reason why I think Northern Monk are, are brewing these beers is because, hey ho, people seem to want it. Um, I need to take, I need to detach my personal feelings away from whether I would buy it or not, and just look at the kind of fundamentals, and the fundamentals are that people want to buy this beer, whether I like it or not. Now, I'm quite annoyed, I'm quite annoyed, because yesterday I reviewed a fantastic, fantastic Northern Monk Faith in Futures IPA that launched into Morrison's. That cost me £3.75 a can, and it was the most amazing IPA that I've ever tried on a supermarket shelf, it was incredible. And I ended up, it got mixed up on my computer, the, 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 the edit, the upload, and I ended up deleting it before I uploaded it to YouTube. So the video's gone. Deleted it off my phone, deleted it off my computer, the video's gone. But the Faith in Futures from, uh, from, from Morrison's, the new one, from Northern Monk as of October, November, uh, September, October 2023, is absolutely incredible. It's the type of beer that I would love to buy and drink all of the time. And the reason why I mention that is because is because on the other side of the coin, Northern Monk can make beers like this, um, beers for other people. Um, I'm just going to have to rate it as a, yeah, I'm just going to have to rate it as a chalk ice. There's nothing else. As a chalk ice, this is probably chalk ice in a glass. It really is. As a stout, the only resemblance and, 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 and feel and taste this has as a, as a stout is the colour. The only resemblance of a stout is the colour. Everything else stout-like is gone. It's just black liquid. If you like chalk ice, go and buy this chalk ice beer from Northern Monk.
if you like a little bit of something more traditional and, and normal, then don't. Um, as a choc ice stout, <laughs> it, it, it's a seven out of ten. I, I can't not not kind of like give it. Even though I probably would never ever drink this beer in my life, it tastes like choc ice, which is exactly what it says on the tin. A bit like one seal. Seven out of ten. Thanks for watching. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer and food reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom. Cheers.